Hello everyone and a warm welcome. In this lecture, you will get to know about father of different branches of biology. This lecture is very important for all the students of biology. So let's get started. The first is father of biology and father of zoology, Aristotle. Aristotle is known as father of biology or zoology because he was the first one to express his views on animal and plant life. He also observed the biological processes for the first time. Next father is father of botany, Theophrastus. He was the first person to research on plants. He gave the term botany. The third father is father of cytology, Robert Hooke. Robert Hooke discovered cell. Actually, he discovered the dead cell from the cock tissue. This cell resembled the honeycomb structure. There are some questions for you. You can answer these questions in the comments. The question number one is, name the book in which Robert Hooke published his findings of cell. Do write the answer in the comment. I will reply back. Next is the father of taxonomy, Carl Linnaeus. Carl Linnaeus developed a scientific way to name living organisms in genus and species name. It was called the binomial nomenclature. Next is father of biology, Johann Hadwig. Continuing with the series, Next father is father of mycology, Pierre Antonio Michele. Question number two for you. Name any two edible fungi. You have to write the name of two fungi which can be eaten. Write the names in the comments. Next is father of microbiology, Antony van Leeuwenhoek. Leeuwenhoek was the first person to discover and describe microorganism. Question number three for you. What was the term given by Leeuwenhoek for the tiny organisms which he observed? Write the answer in the comments. Continuing with it, next father is father of modern microbiology, Louis Pasteur. Louis Pasteur led the theory of the fermentation. He also gave the theory of germ theory of disease. He gave the technique pasteurization and he developed the vaccines, the fall cholera vaccine, rabies vaccine and the anthrax vaccine. Next father is father of medical microbiology or bacteriology, Robert Koch. Robert Koch discovered the pathogens for tuberculosis and anthrax. He let down the criteria for the pathogens which are known as Koch postulates. Oh, next is not father but mother. A lady who has given the title mother of microbiology, lady is Angelina Fanny Hesse. She is called mother of microbiology because she suggested the use of agar as a solidifying agent in the culture medium. Next is father of medicine, Hippocrates. He described disease and their treatment in scientific manner. He coined the terms which are still used today. These terms are symptom, diagnosis, therapy, trauma and sepsis. Next is father of experimental biology and parasitology, Francesco Reddy. He challenged spontaneous generation by demonstrating maggots arise from eggs of flies. Next is father of electrocardiography, Willem Antoven. He gave the technique electrocardiography and the instrument electrocardiograph which is known as ECG machine. Next is father of evolution Charles Darwin. He gave the important theory of evolution. The evolution happens by natural selection. Next father is father of 
बायोकेमिस्ट्री कार्ल एलेक्सेंडर न्यूबर्ग ही डिस्कवर्ड बायोकेमिकल रिएक्शंस ऑफ एल्कोहलिक फर्मेंटेशन ही ऑल्सो डिस्कवर्ड एंजाइम्स कार्बोक्सिलीज एंड इंटरमीडिएट सच एज फ्रक्टोसिक्स फॉस्फेट नेक्स्ट इज फादर ऑफ पैलेंटोलॉजी जॉर्ज क्यूवियर नेक्स्ट इज फादर ऑफ कीमोथेरेपी पॉल एहलिच पॉल एहलिच क्वाइंट द टर्म मैजिक बुलेट ही सजेस्टेड द यूज ऑफ द ड्रग सेलवेरिसन फॉर द ट्रीटमेंट ऑफ सिफिलीज he also explained body's immune response next father is father of antibiotics alexander fleming he discovered the first antibiotic penicillin next is father of green revolution norman borlaug next father of white revolution vergish curian Vergish Curian gave his services and important inventions for dairy industry. Next father is father of antiseptic surgery Joseph Lister. He suggested the use of carbolic acid for hand washing and disinfection of surgical equipments. Next is father of virology Martinus Bajernik. He discovered viruses and gave the state statement contagium vivum fluidum that means contagious living fluid next is father of immunology edward jenner he gave the first vaccine the vaccine against smallpox next father is father of innate and cellular immunology ali metnikoff He discovered phagocytic cells, the cells which digest ingested particles in starfish larvae. Next, father of blood groups, Carl Landsteiner. He discovered that RBCs have antigens because of which there are four blood groups. This was important in the blood transfusion reactions. Next is father of genetics Gregor Mendel. He laid down the fundamental laws of inheritance. Question number 4 for you. What is the scientific name of the plant used by Mendel in his experiments? Write the answer, the name of the plant in the comments. You will get to know whether you are correct or not. Next father is father of mutation Hugo de Vries. He explained that there can be sudden changes in the genes. These changes are called mutations and the changes can be inherited from one generation to the other generation. Next is father of human genetics Sir Archibald Gero. He discovered that there can be inborn errors of metabolism due to genes next is father of modern genetics thomas hunt morgan next is father of radiation biology hermann joseph muller he discovered that mutations can be bring about by the radiation x rays Next is father of tissue culture Gottlieb Haberland. He discovered plant tissue techniques in potato. Question number 5 for you which was the first commercial product obtained from cell culture? Write the answer in the comments. Next is father of modern cell biology George Emil Pellet. He discovered the cell organelles ribosomes. Next is father of DNA fingerprinting Sir Alice Jeffries. He discovered the count repeats in animals, seal, mice and monkey. So you have got to know about the father of different branches of biology. If you like the video, share it with your friends. 
subscribe to the channel for the more interesting and informative lectures thanks for your patient hearing best wishes bye and take care